This is a $21.5 million Santa Barbara mega mansion with some of the best views of the ocean that we have ever seen before. It's got a private glass enclosed guest house, movie theater, private spa, steam room, and so many other things. And today we're going to tour this property in its entirety. But before we do, make sure to subscribe because we're touring more homes just like this one every single week on the channel. Huge thank you to all of the listing agents involved with this listing. And now let's get started. We are here today in bright and sunny Santa Barbara, California, about to tour this remarkable estate here in front of me. You can see I have just walked down that gated vehicle entry here. You also have two stunning water features on either side with this interesting oyster rock detail. If we continue down, you can see you have this massive circular driveway. The frontage of this property is truly remarkable. You have the gravel surrounding this entire section, beautiful centerpiece tree in front of me. The entire front yard is landscaped with tall trees, gorgeous, well manicured plant life here as well. Now let's continue down. In front of me, we have a third water feature with more of the seashell details, beautiful section with this massive grass lot. If you wanna just sit out here, relax, listen to the water, you absolutely could do that. Over on my left, you have a side yard with a little seating section as well, which we will be seeing later. And also I wanted to mention, you have an exact replica of this water feature directly down on the opposite side of this property right here. Beautiful scenery all throughout and the tall trees add plenty of privacy and security to this home. And if we go ahead and continue up, I mean, just take a look at this grand entry for a second. You have the two wrought iron rail doors taking you into this gorgeous courtyard before you enter the property. You've got the light brickwork details surrounding this section, more beautiful trees and plant life surrounds me as well. What a great spot to relax and hang out before you even enter your main property. Now let's continue down. We have this French door access, which leads us directly into the beautiful entry. Right when you walk in, you were just hit head on with unobstructed views of the Santa Barbara ocean. Take a look at that right there. I don't think we've ever seen views quite like this from any great room before. If you look up above me, we've got the gorgeous vaulted ceilings, of course, with all of the wooden beam details, which just adds so much character to the room. It makes the space feel so warm and so inviting. Entertain plenty of guests in this space. You've got the formal dining room section here on my left-hand side with seating for eight at this wooden table. You can also see that similar brickwork that we saw on the outside has been brought to the interior of the property and it actually further extends out here to the backyard. I love that continuity. Again, it adds some additional character to the space right here. Over here, you have this set of sliding glass doors which lead exclusively out to that gorgeous backyard. And of course, we're going to be seeing that later on in the video. You've got tons of seating areas, zero edge pool, fire pit, glass enclosed guest house. You've got a lot to see. Now in front of me, we have the beautiful family room staged with contemporary furniture all throughout. Could you imagine having all of your friends and family here sitting, relaxing, overlooking the ocean views? This is truly a one of a kind view here in Santa Barbara. Now, over here on my right, we have a seating area, glass elevator, and a master bedroom, and a couple of other things. 
Also, right in front of me, this is your impressive fireplace. Take a look at this thing for a second. I'm six foot three for reference, and this is nearly the same height as me. You can see the similar brickwork detail, the light and the dark, wood-burning fireplace. This is such a cool statement piece to have in your very own property. Now, let's continue our tour down back to the entry briefly. I just want to kind of let everyone know how the property floor plan works. So on my left-hand side, we have this private hallway which leads to a staircase taking you down to the lower level. You also have access into a yoga room which has a massive flat screen TV. And down here on my right, this hallway leads into some additional guest bedrooms which we will be seeing later on in the video. Beautiful ambient lighting surrounds this open concept section. Kitchen on my right, again, we'll see it later, but let's continue our tour. This is a nice formal seating section. You have another beautiful wood-burning fireplace with the brickwork details, kind of like the ones we saw in the last fireplace. If you take a look up above me here, you've got more of the wooden paneled ceilings. It looks so incredible. Again, it makes the space feel very warm, very inviting. On the far side of this room, we have a built-in bar section. Imagine serving drinks to your guests overlooking that ocean. Now moving through, this is also a really cool feature. You have this stack of three Louis Vuitton trunks in the area. Really cool. If this was my house, I would definitely have this here too. Now on my left, we've got a flat screen TV. And if we circle down through, this is your glass elevator, which takes you exclusively down to the lower level. And the crazy thing is, that's only the first glass elevator that you have for this property. We actually have a second one, which we will be seeing later. Let's continue down. We have a powder room in front of me with the pedestal sink, very gorgeous wall details, and you've got a skylight above. And if we go ahead and take a direct right-hand turn, we have actually made it into the first section of your primary bedroom suite. First coming in, you have this contemporary seating slash working area surrounded by floating shelving and custom cabinetry all throughout. You've got the mounted flat screen TV in front of me. And if you look up above, we have a continuation of those wooden paneled ceilings with the skylight up above me. I love the natural wooden tones that they have here on these cabinets. Down the stairs there, you have another seating space and access to the bathroom. We'll see it in a second, but before we do, let's continue our tour. This is the primary bedroom suite. Chandelier is positioned above, and you get unobstructed views of your zero-edge pool and the ocean in the distance. Could you imagine waking up to this view every single day? That is truly, truly remarkable. I mean, the sun is just glimmering on that ocean right now. I could probably stare at this all day. This is gorgeous. Now you also have another wood-burning fireplace right here with the brickwork details. I love the curvature that they have, and you also have more of those slanted wooden paneled ceilings up above me. Contemporary furniture is also shown throughout. And if we continue down this set of stairs, take a look at this primary bathroom. So rarely do we see seating sections in primary bathrooms, but this bathroom is so cool, so unique, so full of interesting features. I would just like to sit here and admire it. It's so cool. In front of me, you have this contemporary floating vanity. It's a dual vanity. You've got two sinks, of course. You have the LED light strips illuminating this section, and you also have this unique stonework detail which goes up to the ceiling, and it surrounds this entire bathroom. It feels so cool, so unique in this section. And if you take a look down here, this is something we've never seen before, but we actually have this set of stairs, which takes you down into this sunken in spa slash bathtub area. What a cool spot to sit down, take a bath and overlook your pool, overlook the water features and the ocean. This is remarkable. Now, if we head back up, we got way more stuff to see right here. Also, we have this glass pivot door, which takes you out into a gorgeous water feature. And this side yard further takes you to the backyard. Moving on through, we've got the water closet on my left and on my right, you've got this open concept shower section. I love the stonework design that they have surrounding this entire space. Circular window looks up to some additional foliage. You've got the rain head above me with the built-in body spray, linear drainage, and what's interesting is that this shower is actually kind of curved right here. Very cool, we don't see that very often. 
Now let's continue down through. This is that contemporary seating space that I was mentioning to you a little bit earlier. You've got another wood burning fireplace and a pivot door taking you to the side yard. Moving down through, you've got a preparation space on my right. And if we move on through, you've got the closet. Tons of built-in custom cabinetry is located all throughout right here. And also, in case you have any items that are hard to reach, you just have this pull-down handle, which is always essential to have. You also have these LED light strips, which illuminate all of your cabinet doors. And you've also got this really cool contemporary push to open cabinetry throughout. I love this section. And you can see they've even brought back in that slanted roof detail. We'll see that throughout the entire first level. I love that they incorporated that into every single room. Now over here on my right, this is the second primary bathroom that we have. You've got the floating vanity, fabricated sink, gorgeous patterned stonework goes up to the ceiling with that slanted wood detail. And you have this glass enclosed shower with more beautiful stone and the built-in rain head. Now let's go ahead and continue our tour outside of this section right here. So we've kind of wrapped up the entire right wing of this first level. So now let's go ahead to the left wing and check out that kitchen. We've just made it here into your contemporary kitchen right when you walk in. Before we talk about this, I actually wanna show you in front of me, you've got this glass enclosed wine cellar, floor to ceiling, store hundreds of your favorite bottles of wine right here. And you can see they actually have the glass slanting to match with the slanted roof design. So cool, you've got the brickwork detail inside of there as well. Also, you have this side yard access which takes you to lots of different seating spaces and to the gorgeous backyard which we'll see in just a little bit. You've got some appliances here on my right, gorgeous stone countertops here with that custom cabinetry located below. Of course, it's all soft closing. You've got the stainless steel countertops right here with that fabricated sink. You actually have two fabricated sinks here on the center island. Open this up. This is one of your trash compartments. And then you've got your panel dishwasher, of course, designed by Mila. And you'll see that we actually have Gagano appliances also built in throughout the space. On my right, that's your Gagano double oven setup. Next to that, you have the stainless steel wolf cooktop, and you also have a pot filler displayed above. And if you take a look here on my left, what's really cool is that you have a lot of secret appliances, and I'll show you what I mean. So you can open up this cabinet door right here and take a look. We've just revealed two more stainless steel Gagano appliances and you can close this up. And you can still really maintain that minimalist kitchen design that they really were going for when they designed this place. Moving on through, we've got some more hidden appliances. You've got the Mila espresso machine, which is nicely built into the section. More custom cabinets below, close that up. Can't even tell that it's there. I love how clean, sleek, and minimalist this entire kitchen looks. You have breakfast bar seating for up to four of your guests here at the edge of this countertop. Take a look on my left. You've got the dining section, which can seat up to six. And once again, you're overlooking that impressive ocean view and views of your backyard. We'll go out there in just a bit. Now you also have this seamless access taking you directly to the backyard. Again, we're gonna save this for a little bit later. Make sure to stick around. Skylights bring natural light into the space. And let's go ahead and continue down through the main floor right over here. I wanna head back to that entry and take a right-hand turn where we have a hallway. We have access to a couple different guest bedrooms. Let's take a turn to my left. This is the first guest bedroom that we have off the right wing of the entry here. You can see you have all of your nicely integrated minimalist closet storage, which extends up to the ceiling. Wooden beam detail is also above me. This adds so much additional character to the bedroom. Bed in front of me, you've got the built-in desk area here with the wooden details. Flat screen TV is mounted above. Seating area on my left, and this actually overlooks tons of different entertainment spaces, which is a part of your backyard. And from this vantage point, I get direct views down to the ocean. This is so, so beautiful. 
Now continuing down through, you have this open concept ensuite bathroom with the curtain dividers, which is something I have never seen before until now. Coming through, you've got your built-in vanity with the soft closing cabinetry, waterfall edge, marble countertop, and the sink is nicely slanted right here. So when you turn on that water, you can see right there, very unique. Never seen something quite like that before. You've got the mirror up above, skylight brings natural light into the space. We see more of that wooden ceiling detail and we have your glass enclosed walk-in shower in front of me, which is also nicely tiled throughout with the built-in shelving and the rain head. And if we go ahead and continue outside of this bedroom right here, down the hallway, take a look up above, beautiful slanted ceiling extends all the way down to the opposite side of this hallway and it's got several different skylights brings so much natural light into the space let's go ahead and take a right this is the next guest bedroom that we have for the section of the house you've got these sliding glass doors which lead you out to the side portion of your backyard Beautiful views of the foliage. On my left, you've got an ensuite bathroom with a similar unique vanity like the last bathroom that we saw. You've also got a glass enclosed walk-in shower space right over there. And if we continue down, I just wanted to mention, you've got this glass pivot door, which takes you back out to the front of the property. Now, moving down through, very cool staging elements all throughout with the art pieces. Let's take a turn right over here. This is the third guest bedroom that we have for this right area. We've got these glass doors which take you out to some additional seating spaces. You've got the ceiling detail above me and in front of me, you've got this beautiful ensuite bathroom with a dual vanity. It also has a gorgeous walk-in shower section which is nicely tiled all throughout with these darker tiles, which I do really like. Now let's go ahead and continue on down. We actually have another pivot door taking you to the front of the house. And what's really cool is that you actually have this glass elevator. And this is just the first glass elevator that we have. We actually have another one, which we will be seeing later on. How crazy is that? Now that concludes our tour for this main level. So now we gotta head outside and check out one of my most favorite backyards we've ever seen. We have just made it out here to your remarkable backyard. I have to be honest, I think this is my most favorite backyard we have seen so far on the channel. You have this impressive grass lot, which has unobstructed views of the Santa Barbara Ocean there. Of course, you have a massive zero edge pool, tons of pool chairs, plant life, tall trees, seating sections, fire pit, access to the guest house. I mean, the list just goes on and on out here. First things first, let's talk about the first seating area that you have right when you come out of your great room. Of course, you can have like 15 to 20 people just sitting here relaxing. You also have two more private seating areas on either side of those glass sliding doors, which we did see earlier. Access into the guest bedroom on my right and to the left, we have access into the kitchen, which we did see earlier. We also see more of the brickwork details like we saw on the front side of the property. Now let's go ahead and continue our tour down the section. I also wanted to mention you have this fountain, which actually extends all the way down to this circular part right here in between your two seating areas. And it concludes right over here and it further leads you to another seating space, which can seat six. You also have a fire pit positioned here in the center. I mean, could you just imagine relaxing here on a nice evening? overlooking the ocean. And also from this vantage point, I can hear waves crashing on the shore. And we will have direct views of the rocks and the sand a little bit later when we go down there. Before we do though, I just wanted to go ahead and take you down this stone pathway. I love the gorgeous foliage that surrounds either side of the space. It feels so peaceful and serene, and it kind of feels like we are at a private resort of some kind. This is truly one of a kind. Down below, you have several seating sections and a private trail, which leads you to some beautiful views of the ocean. 
And if we go ahead and continue down, more exterior seating can be found on my left-hand side, which can accommodate up to 10 of your guests. And if we continue down this stone pathway right here, more seating, of course, exterior barbecue, and we've got to go all the way down to the end. You can see more chairs, and you actually have direct access back to the front yard of the house. I love the tall trees right here that surround the entire property. Again, it just makes it feel so much more private and secure. None of your neighbors can see into this house whatsoever. I don't think we've ever seen something quite this incredible. I mean, the backyard is just so vast. Take a look at this. The grass lot also slopes downward, and you can access your guest house from that area. And of course, we'll see in a bit. Before we do, let's continue down. Another massive exterior seating space can be found right here. I mean, you can accommodate hundreds of guests out here in this yard. This is truly remarkable. Now you also have access to the front yard once more. Several more seating areas and pool chairs can be found across this section. But let's go ahead and continue our tour. This is your massive infinity edge pool right here. Nicely tiled around the edges and of course inside the pool as well. You have six staged pool chairs here on the right side of this pool area and you can also see they have actually made individual ePay wooden decks for each set of pool chairs which I think is a really nice detail. Of course you can sit by the pool, relax, look at the ocean, listen to the ocean, feel that cool breeze. This is so amazing. I love all of the real grass that they have around this section. We've got another fire pit and if we go ahead and take a look at this we have something very very cool. Moving through, we have this very unique arrow-shaped water feature. Could you imagine just sitting right here every single day and looking out at these views right here? Unobstructed views of the sea. You can listen to the waves crash, feel the ocean breeze, listen to your water feature down below. This is without a doubt one of the best, best views I have ever seen before. And also one more thing I wanna show you, take a look at the views that you have of your property. I mean, this is just unbelievable. I can't even believe how far away we are from the main house. This is how large your backyard truly is. Now let's go ahead and wrap around the corner just right over here. You can see you actually have another water feature right here, which actually flows down near your guest house. And we're gonna see that guest house in just a second. It's also glass enclosed and it is very unique. Now follow me down this section right over here. Like I said, this is no ordinary grass lot. This is one of the most vast grass areas we've seen. Just take a look at the main house briefly. You can see it goes from there all the way down to this section right over here overlooking the ocean. We have the pedestrian staircase here on my left, but I wanted to take the fun way. I wanted to just walk down the hillside itself. I mean, we are hit with the most breathtaking views of the ocean here in Santa Barbara. These are 100% the best views of the ocean we have ever seen before on this channel. I mean, can you just take a look at this? I literally see a yacht right over there in the distance right now. This is so, so incredible. Over here, you have a private seating section, which of course overlooks the waves. From this vantage point, you can literally hear the waves crashing right down below. You've got beautiful trees, beautiful plant life sectioning off this area. Could you imagine just entertaining here in your backyard and seeing this view every single day? We've never seen something quite like this before. And the value out here is absolutely remarkable. For $21.5 million, you're not gonna get this type of lot with these types of views anywhere else, I can guarantee that. Now let's go ahead and continue our tour. More massive trees, beautiful plant life. We have another seating area displayed right here in front of me with the fire pit in the center. And if we go ahead and wrap around this corner, I did mention this earlier in the tour, we have this secret underground glass enclosed guest house. Just take the glass door in and let's go ahead and check it out. You come inside, you've got several seating sections in the space. Beautiful tiled floors surround this entire section. Wood paneled cabinetry and you see that natural wooden tone actually wraps around this entire 
private bedroom section of this guest house. And when you wake up here every morning, you get direct ocean views here in Santa Barbara, more views of your gorgeous backyard. And if we go ahead and take a look inside of this section right here, this is your ensuite bathroom. You were greeted with a freestanding tub, of course, more tile work details surround the walls and are located here on the floors of this bathroom. Also here on my left, this is your walk-in shower with the fabricated shelving, bench seating below me, linear drainage, and you have the body spray and the built-in rain head. Rain head number one and rain head number two right above me. Very nice section, no glass door or anything. You just seamlessly walk in and out as you please. Cool open concept. And moving through, this is your double vanity setup here. With the sloped sinks, of course, you've got two hanging mirrors on either side and the floating cabinetry down below, and they're all pushed to open, which is a very cool feature. Now back around here, you've got your closet section with all of your necessary built-in items. And once again, I just wanna talk about the views here for a moment. This is so breathtaking. We've never seen anything quite like this before. And of course, all of these glass walls do open up so you can get that seamless indoor-outdoor flow. Also, what a unique location to have your guest house. You have it right next to the gorgeous grass hill. No views of the main house from here. It feels like it's very own private residence. This would be perfect for someone like me to live here. I mean, this is the view. I mean, this is, this is stunning. Now let's go ahead and take a turn outside of the space. We've got a staircase here on my left, which further leads to a beautiful seating area. And these are the views that you have from this space. I mean, can we just take a look at that right there? You see the sand, you see the rocks. You can literally see and hear the waves crashing right down below us. You've got the beautiful plant life, of course, surrounding this section. Could you imagine just sitting here relaxing on a daily basis, listening to that ocean? I mean, I could not think of anything more peaceful and relaxing. Read a book right here, get some work done, look down at the beach. This is truly one of a kind view. Now, that concludes our tour for this backyard. So now, we gotta head back inside the main house and check out the lower level. We have just taken this beautiful stone staircase down to the lower level of the property here on my right. This is where you have access to your glass elevator. Take a look at how cool this is. The coolest elevator we have ever seen. Stainless steel details inside. And of course you can access it from two different sides. We'll see the other side in a bit. Generator room is behind me. And if we continue through, this is a nice contemporary relaxation area, a massage room. In case you wanna meditate in the space, you absolutely could. Floating shelving in front of me with the LED strip lights. You get tons of natural light from that open atrium that we saw at the staircase. And you also have tons of cabinet storage around this section. If you take a look right here, the doors actually slide back in a very interesting way. Take a look, you've got tons of cabinet space all throughout. Certain cabinets here also have some pull-out drawers. And if we go ahead and continue our tour down, I mean, just take a look at this beautiful spa. You have a couple staged pool chairs inside of this room. And then the main event, this is your private jacuzzi, your spa area. This is where you come downstairs after a long day and you just sit and relax. You've got this unique stonework detail which extends up to the ceiling. And this also is a water feature too. Very cool space. You could have a couple friends or family down in this section too. Movie theater in front of me, but before we see that, let's continue our tour. We have a couple unique items to see. And the first one that we have to show you is this right here. Take a look at this room. Take a look at the unique mosaic tile work that they have throughout this entire section. And if you look up above, you have another different color to complement the space with the metallic stars up above me. Massive rain head above. This also is a steam shower. You have the touch screen right over here. It's a Mr. Steam, really cool space. Imagine relaxing in your hot tub and you come inside here, relax in your steam room. Of course, this section is all glass enclosed with this translucent door. 
And if we take a look to my left, we've got your sauna, of course, directly next to that steam room. You just sit right here, maybe after a workout, relax. You've got the wood panel detail all across the section right here. This is so, so great to have, especially in the comfort of your very own home. Also, of course, it is glass enclosed. And if we go ahead and take a turn around the corner here, we've just made it into your movie theater, staged with contemporary furniture all throughout. Once again, massive flat screen TV is positioned here on the far side of the wall. You've got some built-in shelving sections with the wooden tone cabinetry all throughout. I love the LED strip lighting that illuminates all of the shelving in this area. This space can fit at least like seven to 10 of your guests. Come down here, watch the game, watch your favorite movie. Now moving on through, you also have a wet bar section with the built-in stainless steel sink and you also have a built-in Miele microwave up here in case you wanna have your popcorn in the movie theater. Stainless steel cabinetry right below and if we go ahead over here, take a look at this. This is the alternate entrance here into your glass elevator. I mean, how cool is this seriously? Having a glass elevator in any house is such a rare and unique feature. And that concludes our tour today for this beautiful home here in Santa Barbara, California. If you made it to the end, thank you so much for watching. Huge thank you to all of the listing agents involved with this property. You can find their info down below in the description. Make sure to subscribe and I'll see you in the next one.